The journey to cloud begins with discovery and assessment phase. A complete understanding of your enterprise needs, and its technical realities is important. Cloud's Intel by Click2 Cloud is one such platform that helps you discover your IT inventory, assess that inventory, collects the Intel for different categories manually and automatically to take decisions on moving your workloads to cloud. Based on the discovered inventory the site finally provides a TCO report for the user that clarifies the source and destination costs. Let us see how to use Cloud's Intel, go to the Cloud's Intel URL where you need to first log in. You can log in with your credentials. If you are connecting for the first time, click on register. The registration screen opens where you need to enter your details and press on register and continue. After registration, click 2 Cloud Team will approve the access. After successful login, you will be redirect to the dashboard of Cloud's Intel. Here you can view the reports of TCO comparison, total cost of ownership comparison between source and destination. The source can be on-premise or cloud. Destination is cloud. CapEx OPEX view, here you can view the capital expenditure and operational expenditure on source and destination. Discounted cash flow. Financial data like NPV, IRR, ROI, annual savings percentage. On this page you can observe selection for nomination and assessment in the top right half of the page. The reports changes per these selections. The help button provides the help for this page. On the top left side of the page, you can observe go to nomination button. Click on this to go to the nominations and assessments page. Using this page, you can add a new nomination. Here, fill all the details to add new nominations. Click on save button to save your nomination details. Success prompt confirms the saving of nomination details. Once the nomination is created you can view the list of nominations as shown in image under nomination list. To view exiting nominations, you can use the search box or use year selection to view all nominations for selected year. Now, the next step is to create an assessment. The assessment provides the actual process from inventory discovery to reports. Press on go to assessment button. The flow then goes to page where you can add assessment or view existing assessment. Click on the add assessment button which is in the top right hand corner of the assessment page. Fill the details to add an assessment. Provide a name, assessment type, source, destination, a new assessment is created. On pressing add button the new assessment card is displayed. In assessment card, select tool this takes you to select tool page. This page displays the list of various tools that you can use for discovery and assessment. On selecting the tool on the left, right side panel describes how to use the tool. You must download the tool, install it, run it and get results in CSV format. Instructions for this is provided in the description for each tool. Select tool and press on save button. The name of selected tool gets added to your assessment card. Click on upload inventory. The flow takes you to the upload inventory page. On this page you can select the files that the tool has created and upload them from your local machine to the assessment card. Here the name of the required file is noted. The icon besides it is for downloading the sample template. Click on upload button. This will ask you to select the file in your local machine. Select the appropriate file. Select the same step for all other files. Use the validate and dump button to validate the file and load the file to the assessment DB. If validation fails you would need to check the file that is properly being uploaded. If you have select the wrong file it will not validate it. Verify it against the sample template and re-upload the file. Once successful upload, the success message is shown besides the file. Click on Submit button. The flow goes back to the assessment card and the Upload Inventory selection gets green. Now, click on Q&A. The flow takes you to Maturity Assessment page where you can select the appropriate answers that relate to the organization. Once all the questions are answered, you can click on Submit Assessment on the last question set. Click on Select Resources VM in the assessment card. The flow takes you to the page where you can view the list of VMs that are discovered. You need to select the VMs for which you wishes to view the costing. After this, you can check on premises cost. Similarly, for database, select the resources database to view the list of databases that are discovered. You need to select the database for which you wishes to view the costing. Now, for cost calculator. Click on VM. It shows a list of different clouds that is a compute resource. The use of this cost calculator is that you can get the costing of each of these VMs on different clouds. 
Now, select database. Database shows the costing of different clouds. Now go to customer input. If you want to view existing customer input, select view. It will list down existing cost types. For new, click on add new button. It will redirect to TCO assumption page. At the top right corner click on plus icon. Add the input name. Click on add. Save the details. After all the details filled in assessment card. You can view the report. What all inventories you have collected till now will list down in report. Once you have completed the source versus destination costing, Clouds Intel provides insights on some important financial analyses reports which help in proper decision making for moving to desired destination cloud provider. This gives out direct comparison of cost for all resources or services on the source and destination. This is the TCO report called as the total cost of ownership. Clouds Intel first does a business value assessment comparing the source and destination costs. Based on the above factors Clouds Intel provides NPV, the IRR and ROI values for the inventory and resources selected. You will get a CAPEX versus OPEX comparison which helps in understanding the costs that can be reduced in setting up the resources or in managing these resources on a day-to-day -day basis. It will provided you with an estimate regarding the future cash flows and helps in determining the present value of the investment. This clarifies if it's a sound investment decision in moving to some destination cloud or to stay with your current setup. The company can make a sound judgment on the payback period of the investment made and understand the benefits that can be reaped every year after break even. So Clouds Intel shows its capability as an effective technical tool and also as an expert financial reporting tool. This is the generic overview of how to work on Clouds Intel to know the basic needs of cloud before opting for migration. With Click2 Clouds Clouds Intel, enterprises benefits with a complete insight into the IT inventory before going for migration. Gives a clear roadmap for identifying the cost estimation. Saves overall time, effort, and cost. Stay tuned for more videos with us at click2cloud.com. Thank you for watching.